support Ireland's growing economy and the Minister's expectation that we will have 2,043,000 people at work by the end of 2017, we must continue to enhance our international personal tax competitiveness on two fronts. We must reduce the domestic tax burden on our current workforce and we must improve our ability to attract foreign people to Ireland with a favourable expatriate tax regime. While some measures announced by the Minister are positive, we still have a long way to go in improving our position. Speaking firstly on our domestic regime, there have been some positives, with the USC reductions and an increase in the home care or credit. Measures have also been announced to assist entrepreneurs with a 10% capital gains tax rate for those selling their business on gains of up to 1 million. On the negative side, it is disappointing that there is still a discrepancy between the taxation treatment of those who are self-employed and employed, and also that we have to wait until Budget 2018 for positive changes to the taxation treatment of share-based remuneration relevant to SMEs. Turning to our competitive position to attract foreign employees to Ireland, we have a favourable expatriate regime in the Special Assignment Relief Programme. The relief exempts 30% of an individual's employment income, over 75,000, from Irish tax for a period of five years, provided certain conditions are met. We welcome the Minister's announcement to extend this relief to 2020.